The Little Village is the largest Mexican community in the city of Chicago. In the neighborhood, we have two rival gangs who have been battling for the last 40 years. The rate of youth homicide is more than any other neighborhood in the city of Chicago. My wife's a teacher, and so we moved into Little Village back in 1998 because this is where she got her first teaching placement. Here, it's dangerous. You get shot out of, like, nowhere. Well, lots of our kids in our neighborhood deal with trauma of seeing things that they shouldn't see, and how are they able to cope, and how are they able to connect with other people? And I think a lot of that comes through play. Coach Rob teaches us how to be a leader, not a follower. Beyond the Ball has historically used play to bring people together. What we do is we take the play to them. Today we're gonna to be having a soccer tournament with the brand new portable soccer stadium that Chevrolet has donated to us. It allows us to take structured play to public spaces and help people who live around them make them safe. When I was walking, I was speechless. When I saw the pitch for the first time, it was amazing because kids haven't really been able to come out and play. I was like, are you serious that we got this? Once you start playing, it's like you're having fun. You don't have to worry about nothing, just have fun. Being a father, I know how much as a parent you want your kids to avoid growing up in a troubled environment. And this sort of intervention in particular is absolutely invaluable. When you play, you forget everything. You feel happiness and freedom. We're not gonna be able to stop gang violence. But what we can do is we have an impact on the resiliency of our kids and how they're perceiving their community amidst all the violence. The dream is that people will see Little Village as a place that they want to live and stay and not try to escape, a place where their kids are able to play safely.